Hello friends, this video on 3 dimensional geometry part 26 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 25. Now let's understand a new topic called distance of a point from a plane. Before solving this, let me reiterate. When you say r dot n cap, you get small d. This small d is nothing but distance of this plane from center. When you say r dot n vector is equal to its other d, this d is not the distance of plane from the center. Okay, so let's start with this now. So we have some point A. This is some A point. We have to find the distance of some plane. Let's suppose there's a plane here from this point A. That means we have to find this distance. To find this distance. Okay. And the equation of the plane is let's suppose this distance is uh, d a distance of a from this and the equation of the plane is r dot n cap is equal to b this is the equation of this plane that means if i from here i draw one more perpendicular this guy this guy is d distance clear because the equation of the plane is r dot n is equal to d that means i take any point r on this and we have this and this is n vector actually this is n vector right that is where it is told so i have to find this distance how to find this distance so this is a and let's suppose i have some r vector This guy is let's suppose from R vector in this plane, R vector, right? So this vector, if you see this vector which I am joining now, this guy, they join just now, is what R minus A. This guy is A, this guy is R. So this one with the dotted line, a little thick actually this one. The thick one is nothing but R minus A. Correct. So if my this direction is n n n uh, n cap, this direction is also n cap. Please note, right? Because both are parallel. This guy is also n cap. So if you see my r minus a, that is this vector dot n cap has to be equal to d a. I'm looking for. So if you see this like this, this is my n cap. This guy is r minus a right and i am looking for this distance actually this distance so r minus a dot n cap is nothing but the projection of r minus a on this direction and this is nothing but my d because this point is my point a please see and so clearly here this is my point a this is my r vector this guy is nothing but my r minus a vector right this is my point a r minus a vector right and this is my n cap correct and i want this distance only this is the distance i'm looking for so r minus a dot n cap that is projection of r minus a on this n cap direction will give you the distance of point a from this plane this is nothing but r vector dot n vector minus a vector dot n cap is going to da and r dot n is nothing but this d we already know that is this d minus a dot n is equal to da i am looking for since i am looking for da so let me put on the left side this is d minus a vector dot n and that is my direction very simple one actually just to think here i have this a vector from here i have to find this distance 
I know that distance of this guy plane from the center is d and distance of this plane from this center will be r minus a that is this guy projection of this in this direction in this direction nothing but n cap direction so that is nothing but r minus a dot n cap correct let's do the same thing in the cartesian form so the formula we derived was r dot n cap minus a dot n cap is equal to distance i am looking for right this is what we got so let us assume the plane is ax plus by plus cz is equal to b the normal plane equation we get and let this r point a point b some x1 i plus x2 z plus x3 k cap right there will be some point a here and this point will be x1 y1 z1 so n see please note this n uh, vector in this will be ai bj ck ai plus bj plus ck so n cap will be what n cap will be ai plus bj plus ck divide by root of a square plus b square plus c square correct my equation says the distance i am looking for is nothing but r dot n cap that is r is any point xi plus yj plus zk any point dot n cap that is this guy ai plus bj plus ck by root a square plus b square plus c square right minus a dot n right a dot n is what a dot n is this guy x i x1 a is x1 i plus y1 j plus z1 k please note a is x1 x2 x3 actually sorry x1 y1 z1 actually x1 y1 z1 so a is x1 y1 z1 right dot n again and n is a, a b c by root a square plus b square plus c square so a i b j plus c k by root a square plus b square plus c square correct so this if you get is nothing but a x plus b y plus c z minus this you get is a x1 plus p y1 plus c z1 and the whole thing divides by a square plus b square plus c square right a x b y c z is nothing but d so this becomes d minus a x1 b y1 c z1 by root a square plus b square plus c square so this is the distance i have for the point x1 y1 z1 right from this plane a x plus b y plus c z1 so let's take some examples on this i have to find the distance of each this point from this plane so the point is minus 3 2 1 and the plane is this so this is a this is b this is c right so i know the distance is nothing but d minus a x1 plus b y1 plus c z1 by root of a square plus b square plus c square correct what is the value of d d is minus 3 here right minus 3 minus what is a 2 
x1 3 2 into 3 plus d is minus 1 into y1 is minus 2 plus c is 2 and z1 is 1 by root of a square that is 2 square b square that is minus 1 square c square is 2 square so this you get is minus 3 minus 6 plus 2 8 plus 2 10 correct so minus 3 minus 10 that is minus 13 by it's become 4 plus 1 5 plus 4 9 root 9 is 3 magnitude of this that is 13 by 3 so the distance of point this from this plane is 13 by 3 easy one or difficult I have this point I have this plane I can very well use the formula and get the distance Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.